so good morning all today we will learn about escape sequence in python okay first of all we should know why do we need escape sequence why do we need escape characters see sometimes we need to add the illegal characters we we have to insert the illegal characters in a string that are invalid okay so we use escape characters followed by the character followed by a character okay and we use it in a string like if we are using the double quotes in a string that is also enclosed within a double quotes so that is followed by backslash i already told you so let's see practically let's do practical how to use it and what are the types of escapes characters or sequences are with us okay dear so let's see here the backslash okay escape sequences okay that is treating is uh, that is treating it as a normal text fine fine so we will see just suppose if i want the output like first uh suppose i am writing simple here apple okay then backslash n okay then i am writing here mango fine then now i want to pro, uh, i want the output okay that apple uh, and the in the next line mango will come fine so how to do that i will write here print okay double quotes then simple apple okay then backslash n then <coughs> i will write here without space mango fine double quotes close okay so let's run it and see the now you can see it in the output here apple has come and the mango has come and they are aligned from the left side okay they are aligned from the left side so if we will go back and just suppose if i will add here print double uh, double backslash what will happen here okay now i will add here double quotes and i am writing here apple and then simple backslash two backslash and n then again i am writing here mango quotes and the close let's see the output here now you can see here slash n is treating app this line as a normal text okay it is appearing like apple slash and mango fine so it is treating it like as it is okay if suppose now i will write here and i have to if you will write instead of n also if you will write here simply apple okay and <clears throat> backslash t okay mango double backslash and this fine so let's run it and see there is no difference because it is treating these because i have added now double backslash okay so it is treating it as a normal text if i uh, if i will simp write down if i will write down here that backslash apple okay then uh backslash okay then i will write t then i will write mango word i will close it okay simple let's see now you can see here is a space between apple and mango when i am using single backslash and with the with the letter t okay so t is here used to give a space fine and slash n is here to use to bring the text in the next line fine to bring the text in the next line fine so let's go back again and see just suppose now just suppose now you can you know you can also get the backslashes at the back to close it fine like suppose i am writing here mango is uh suppose i am writing i love mango very much okay i am writing this line here and at the end i am putting 1 2 3 
four backslashes okay then i'm writing double quotes okay closing let's see the output carefully i have put the four backslashes here so you can see here in the output you are what you are getting two backslashes okay if i will enter here uh, if i will enter here eight backslashes okay here i if i will write here eight four more one two three four and i will close the double quotes and then let's see the output you will see i am getting four backslashes at the end okay now let's just make it more uh, you know just for the understanding move forward if i want the output like okay if i want the output like uh, uh, suppose i want backslash okay and i want double quotes and again backslash and i want single quote okay if the output i want the output like this what i will do okay i will write print bracket okay then double quotes fine then backslash double quotes okay again backslash okay single quote fine after that i will simply close it with the bracket fine so let's run it and see what is the output i am getting here now double quotes and the single quote but there is no space between them because i have not given the space here okay if i will write it again with space okay just here let's see backslash okay space then i will write here double quotes there is i don't need okay then again i want to write backslash okay this fine then i have to close it fine this if i will run this program now in the output you can see that i have got the i have got the space between double quote and single quote okay so here you can see fine so now let's go back now let's go back and just uh, let's understand a bit more okay let's understand it if i will write just suppose if i will write here three backslashes instead of writing these two and all that okay if i will write here three backslashes just see okay here fine one two three okay three backslashes then i am writing double quotes fine then again space i am writing here one two three backslash single quote okay and for closing it i need to put the double quotes and this let's run it now now you can see you are getting the answer you are not simply getting double quotes and you are not simply getting single code as we were getting previously okay now we are getting here uh, getting here quotes with the single backslash how it is coming now the output let's understand here okay fine so look carefully okay if you want the output okay if you want the output like just suppose i am writing here like this way okay so what would be the output for this for this output would be only the single quote okay just assume it is x fine just assume it is x okay now again if i am writing here double quotes uh, sorry double backslash what would be the output here yes the output would be single backslash now assume it y clear now when will when we will combine x and y okay so what will happen here 2 2 and 1 backslash they will combine they will become 3 backslash okay and uh, you will get the output like this way 1 2 3 backslashes okay single quote then the output would be what would be the output single backslash and this so this is how we get the output here like this one that's why we got the single single okay uh, backslash 
i hope you have understood this now the con concept is clear okay why we are using all these escape sequence okay thank you if you like my video then give likes write comments and please subscribe my channel to get more creative contents